set, go. What's going on guys and welcome back to the channel now in today's video I got some absolutely epic stuff to share with you because you're gonna be seeing not only one of the highest kill games I've had in Fortnite in a very very long time But we are also gonna be looking at the newest footage of the brand new Potter Fort Which is gonna be added into the game later this week I'm gonna run through all the information we currently have and even show you what that new fort will look like when you place that grenade down in a round of Fortnite if you log into the game right now, you can see this new item on your news tab, which is described as the new portable fort, which sprouts a quick defensive position upon impact. So the way that this item works is pretty self-explanatory. It's a lot like a boogie bomb where when it impacts with the ground, it immediately detonates, except this time, instead of making your enemies dance, it sprouts a fort from the ground, which you can use to take cover from your enemies. Now, as a concept, this is really, really interesting to me. And I think it's going to really be an item that will be for the more kind of beginner Fortnite plays than the experienced ones. Most people who've played the game a bit are pretty damn good these days at constructing a quick little one by one fort to take cover from the enemies, and I can't really see them needing this that much. But for beginners who really haven't learned that skill set yet, this could be a really, really cool item to let them actually, you know, build in fights and get a little bit of cover from all that gunfire. Now, obviously, the most important question is, is this new fort any good? What does it look like in-game? And can you actually really take cover in it? And the answer to that is yes. I actually realized early today, if you zoom in on the grenade, you could see a picture of what the fort looks like on the side. But then the Fortnite developers were nice enough to confirm my suspicions by releasing the gameplay trailer for this new item just a few hours ago. And in that, we can see the exact design and the exact way this fort is going to look when you put it down in game. So for those of you who didn't get a good enough look in the trailer just then, let me show you what this fort is going to look like when you place it down in a real round of Fortnite. So right here, you can see it's got a pretty standard one by one construction at the bottom. Now we don't know what the internals of it look like yet. So I've just put a bit of a placeholder staircase in the middle because, well, we don't know what Epic's going to do on that front. Then at the top, you've got these great arched areas, which you can peek over the edge on to get that height advantage and peek at your enemy. Now, the obvious weakness of this base is the fact that if you're on one of these edges and an enemy starts shooting at it, well, if they manage to destroy it, you will plop straight out of the base onto the ground and be extremely vulnerable to enemy fire. But I am really excited for this to get added into the game and we're not going to know how strong or weak it is until it comes out. Now guys, the Porta Fort comes out in just a couple of days. Now I'm going to have a video out showing all the uses for it the second this thing lands in the game. And like I said, even though I don't think I'll personally be using it too much to construct my bases for me, I can imagine so much trolling potential with this thing. And well, I can't wait to show all of that stuff off to you guys. But without further ado, let's go get ourselves an epic victory royale. All right, I want to start this game off with a bang. We're going to come straight down on the Tilted Towers. Land on... Ooh, I don't know. Where do we want to go? We haven't been to, like, my original Tilted Towers drop spot in a while. We used to always go to the apartments. Or recently I've been going apartments. But I kind of want to go back down to our old house this time. Oh, we got a lot of people. I reckon we got, like, 10, 10, 15 people in Tilted Towers. Man, if they actually end up destroying this place with a comet, as much as I'm going to be happy, I'm also going to be sad. And... Oh, you poor, poor Dark Voyager. No, you don't. All right, there we go. We got two shotguns. The perfect way to start a round of the Tilted Towers. Let's get all our slots sorted out and let's find where this other guy is. Because I hear one or maybe even two other people in here. And I think one of them is around that corner. Right there. And there we go, dude. The pump action shotgun to the face is just brutal. Like, I, I honestly don't even know how I feel about being able to one-shot people from like 10, 20 meters away, but when it works in my favor, it's fine. Okay, we got another enemy downstairs. And a gnome. We should probably focus... Oh, he just opened the door. He's gonna be over here. No, my kill. You son of a... That was mine. You know what? It's fine. We've got three kills already. We've got all the guns we need. Well, minus a, you know, standard assault rifle, but I reckon we are gonna be good to move out. Let's go, go, go. All right. Let's see if anyone came through here. Oh, yep. Okay. That's all been looted. Let's go up. Oh, wait. Screwed the jump up. There's an enemy above. Right there. Hello. And... Oh, my God. Where is he? Oh, please. Please. Oh, thank God. Dude, I just like... Shotgun battles 
I am always convinced I'm going to get one shot to the face. Okay. There's another guy in the building too. Let's deal with him next. Have we got a chest down here? Oh, there's a chest in the car. All right. Let's see whether or not we can get shields. Get ourselves up to just a little bit over 100. No shields, but impulse grenades. And you're not allowed to complain about those. Okay. Let's go find this guy. Maybe he'll have the shields that I need. Hopefully. Probably not. Knowing my luck. All right. Where is he? He's not on the roof. Oh, right there. Right there. Drop. Oh, no. It didn't let me build. Come on. We got to get back up there. I don't know if he knows where I am. Where is he? He's there. What the? How did that first shot miss? Come on. Peek again. Oh, right there. Screw it. We're going in. I can't wait any longer. This is taking way too long already. Where is she? Where? Oh. And there we go. Finally. Dude, that took so much longer than it should have. But just... Oh, there's another enemy. There's another enemy. He's down there. Oh, where's he gone? Clock tower? Hello. And... What? Another shot. That I don't know how that missed. That, that first shot was right on. Let me see that again. I swear I even got like a hit marker there. But there was no damage number. Unless I'm wrong. In which case, you guys are probably looking at the slow-mo right now, thinking that I'm an idiot. We're just going to keep on working our way around Tilted. And... Oh. Footsteps. Footsteps. And... Uh, oh, no. Oh, no, 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 no. No, no, no. It's a fake noob. It's a fake noob. You know the ones who dress in the basic skins, but they actually know what they're doing? That guy knows what he's doing. I think. Maybe I said that too soon. We got to get out of here. Let's run around the back. We're going to get the high ground advantage. We're going to come up above him. And then we're going to shoot him in the head because I got no meds right now. Come on, where is he? Right there. And one more shot. Come on. Where is he? Right there. Oh, thank God. Oh, you son of a gun. I hate people who do that, man. I mean, maybe he's just, you know, one of the smart people who doesn't waste a dumb amount of money buying virtual items. But just people who are good at the game but are in default skins, they terrify me. It's like the ultimate bamboozle. I run in all confident, and then I get shot in the face every time. Okay, well, there's been some serious fights going on here. We are at seven kills already, though. This has been a seriously action-packed start to the game, and we ain't done yet. We've only cleared, like, half a Tilted Towers. We've got a long, long way to go. We need more resources, more materials, and especially right now, more meds, because we only have 30 HP. Impulse grenades in case we got a... Oh, enemy right there. Come on... I want to get the kill. I feel like we got to go for this kill. We need meds. And... Oh, please just stand still. All of the meds on the ground will have been picked up at this stage. We need a kill. We need this kill. Oh my god, another missed shot. Please. What? Lag. Lag. Holy crap, if we died right there. Okay, come on. 190. And I need one more shot. Where is he? And there we go. Okay. Meds. Meds. Oh, thank God. Mini shields and bandages. So, so good. Let's get inside. We're going to get shielded up. There's another enemy. Oh, no. And there it is. Oh, thank God. And a med kit. Dude, we are getting exactly what we need delivered to our front doorstep right now. Okay, we're going to get all the way back up. 100 HP, 50 shields, and then we're going to think about our next fight. All right, well, that went from being one of those, like, I'm pretty sure we're going to die situations to something pretty okay. We got a scar. We got the two shotguns that I like using, a bolt-action sniper, and we're pretty well healed. Although, I'd love it if we could find some spare shields to go along with it. An enemy right there. Sit still. Oh, dude. That's one of those kills you feel bad about. I don't know what it is about sniping someone who's just sitting still. Like, it's kind of like Darwinism. If you're going to sit still... Oh, enemy destroyed that tree. Oh, no. Please. Oh, big hits. And there it is. This game is insane. It's just non-stop people. All right. What? My gun's in the... My gun... God damn, I hate this glitch. All right. Let's reload our gun. Let's get all the ammo, all the meds. We'll go check what's in that airdrop. Something is bound to go wrong very soon. Because things never go this right for this long. Something always comes out of nowhere and shoots you in the head. Quite often, it's a bullet. 
Okay, we've got a blue one of those. We've already got the purple scar. I'm trying to make sure I don't leave anything good behind. And okay, here's what we're going to do. We're going to build out to the drop and we're going to do it with the triangles. This, for anyone who ever needs to run out on the lake, on Loot Lake, make sure you always build like this. It's the way to go. And then, okay, what do we got? I can't even see. It's a big shield potion. I'm going to just, you know what? We're just going to build ourselves some cover. I don't like sitting around like this. It's very nerve wracking. Ooh, we got two shield potions. If someone shot me under that wall, I'd be so mad. Okay, what else is there? Oh my god, it's a minigun. <laughs> Alright, well, we're not taking the minigun, that's for sure. We'll keep the big shield potion, leave the med kit behind, and you know what? I want to keep the tempo up. Like, honestly, right now, this could be a kill record game. I don't remember- I think my current kill record is 21. So we could actually go for something that I haven't been able to beat in a very long time. I don't even remember the game where we last set my kill record. But 21 is the number for us to beat. And right now, oh, it'd be tough. But if we get lucky, if we keep running into enemies on the way into the zone, I reckon we could pull it off. Enemies over there. Well, I'm guessing there are enemies over there just because it's a giant field. And there's always someone that's running into the zone from Anarchy Acres. Let's see though. I don't reckon there's anyone left up there. Seems like they've had a big old fight and then decided to go. There's a chest up in that roof though. Oh, I just don't know, man. I don't want to sit around and loot. We need to be killing. We need to be shooting every single second. What? Look, someone built one of these. That's so weird and unique. I never, I've never seen people actually use them non-sarcastically. All right. Enemies straight ahead though. Looks like this base right here is pretty empty. We need to get in there right now. We need to kill these people before they kill themselves. Because right now, with 13 enemies left alive, it's getting harder and harder for us to actually reach that 20 number. We need to be getting kills. I need to get us up to that, like, 15 pretty damn soon. The closer you get towards the end of the round, the easier it is to get, like, a larger share of the kills. But, oh, did he see me? Maybe he did. And, oh no. My kill. My kill. My kill! Oh, he's not dead. Here we go. Where is he? He's healing. Oh, there we go. All right, that guy's dead. Where's that enemy? Where the hell was that enemy? He's under here. Is he under there? I actually don't know. Give me the shield potion. He's under there. I need to get up. Oh God, what do I do here? Where is he? And please die. Thank you very much. All right, we got to get healed up. We're gonna get healed up right now. Luckily, we just found that shield potion to go with it. We're gonna see if that dude had any spare meds, because we've learned our lesson, which is that we always want to be carrying meds from now on. And then we gotta get inside the zone. What do we got? Oh, he didn't really have any meds. He had a boogie bomb. Oh no. No, I gotta get in the zone, dude. It's coming. You gotta run, bro. He literally just took off all my shields. I am not happy right now. Here we go. Let's get these meds. We've got. A, uh, we've got a launch pad, which we can use if we need to. But ideally, I don't want to do that. Ideally, I want to get in the zone. I want to make sure this guy isn't going to shoot me from the side while I'm trying to get in. And then we're going to deal with him in a second. Although, oh my god, no, there are two people fighting. We're going to kill him and use the launch pad. Oh, look at those shots. Come on. Get the kill. Get the kill. There we go. All right. He's hurt. We gotta go. Oh, do we use the launch pad? No, we've got... Oh, no, we can make it. We can make it. It's gonna hurt. But we've got bandages to get us all the way back to 75. And then hopefully, we can find ourselves some shields pretty damn soon. Because right now, on the med front, we are not looking great. And, oh my god, you know what? We're gonna go for this chest. Just because I need shields right now. We can't afford to not find shields really soon. And, okay, more bandages. You know what? Still worth it. Let's get in the zone. That way, at the very least, we're going to have something to heal up with after we've used all this gear. And okay, shotgun over there. Let's build ourselves a little bit of a cocoon. Get healed up. And then we'll think about where to go next. I heard an airdrop coming down. We've got a launch pad, so we can pretty much get wherever we need to go inside the zone. But, I mean, we're going to have to be really bloody careful because right now, not many bullets and we are dead. Six bandages spare, though. And I'm hoping, oh, I'm hoping that the next person we run into is really not good at the video game. Because that'll mean we can get a quick, easy kill. And hopefully they're going to have a whole bunch of meds left over. 
All right, 13 shields left, which honestly is a really big factor when you're this low. And I'm just wondering where I... Oh, enemy right there. Did you guys see him? He was right there. Right there. Total newbie. And what do we got? Oh my god, he had an RPG. Brother. My man. That's what I'm talking about. All right. We're in business. And any... I mean, I don't know what would be in there that I need. But no, he didn't have shields. He did have that gold RPG though. And you know what? You're never going to turn that down. Anything over there? I just see a lot of wood, a lot of resources. I'm assuming this all got looted. Oh, wait. Wait, how do we get in there? I need to get in. Oh, big shield. Someone has a guided rocket launcher. We need to go for it. I need that guided rocket launcher ASAP. You guys know I'm a little bit addicted to those things. And it's over to the northeast. That's going to be our next target. They're normally so frustrating to get. Because you have to kill the person who's using it. And they are often like... Of course there were mini shields in there right after I drank my big shield. But normally, actually running at a person and attacking a person who has the guided rocket launcher can be an absolute pain. But I'm hoping we can pull it off. Okay, enemy over there. We're going to build our way up on this hill. I reckon we're going to put our launch pad down now. Okay, here we go. Enemy's over there. Let's go. Where is he? Where is he? Are they over here? Right there. I see him. Oh, God. And how aren't you dead? Bro, we gotta be careful. No! Oh my god, I was trying to block that whole time, but I couldn't build fast enough. Okay, we're gonna hunt that guy down next. Right now, I want that med kit. I wanna edit that. I'm gonna wall myself in. And then I'm coming for you, you self homing missile son of a gun. Here we go. And nope, you're not getting in. Sorry, brother. The way is shut. Now you must die. Okay. More minis. Thank you very much. A full stack of 10. Okay. I hope you guys are ready. Because we are about to hunt that son of a gun down. I don't know where he is. I don't know what he wants. Well, he, he wants to kill me. I do know what he wants. But we are going to get him next. Okay. We got our launch pad up on this mountain here. That's what we're going to use. Okay. He just shot another one. But where did it come from? It's all the way over there. Does he know I'm here? Oh, I don't think he does. No, he definitely didn't. Okay. Come on, shoot one more. I need to know where it's coming from. One more. You know what? We're going to jump up now. Where are you? He's got to be in the trees. I think he must be in the trees. Oh, big shield potion. Give me that. Right there. Right there. We just saw him. Okay, we gotta build this up. Build this up right now. Holy crap. Get me healed. And then we're gonna go in. Don't shoot me down yet. Okay, here we go. No, 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 no. You don't, you son of a... Here we go. We're going to knock that whole thing down. Come on. Take out the supports. There we go. All right. He's right there. Right there. Oh my God. We just nailed him. But then we got shot from behind. That's not good. Get me healed. Give me the minis. We've got to get this guy before he heals up. Where is he? Come on. And. Give me the shot. Okay, where was that last guy? We've got one enemy left, guys. Holy crap, that was so nerve-wracking. I actually didn't know if we were going to be able to get that. Give me that homing rocket launcher right now. Give me the shields. Let's do this. Holy crap, this is intense. Okay, we've got to build ourselves in. We've got to get shielded up to the max. And then let's think about what to do here. First things first, we've got to figure out where this last guy is. I would love to go for round number two of actually killing the dude while riding a rocket. You guys remember last time we were robbed. I'm pretty sure I saw the last guy as well. He didn't look like he was an absolutely amazing player or anything. He, oh, I see him actually. Oh my god, I see him. He's, all, he's on my hill. He's on my launch pad hill. Well, guys, we can do this. We can absolutely do this. Get ready. Wish me luck. 
Because we are either about to ascend into glory or throw the game in a horrible and embarrassing way. And honestly, when it's me we're talking about, I feel like we got 50-50 odds of either of one of those things happening. Okay, here we go. Turn it around. Bring it back. Here we go. I'm on it. I'm on it, guys. He's on the launch pad. You son of a... I'm still on it. Oh my god. We're going to have to go again. Well, we hit him once. We're going to have to give this one more go. Where is he? I think he's over there. Let's uh, let's just build it in a spot where he's not going to be able to kill me when, I, uh, when, I, when I'm doing this. All right. Where is he? Okay. We got it. Where is he? Where is he? Where is he? Come on. Where is this guy? Come on. Oh, I see him right there. He's right there. He's right there. We gotta go up here. We gotta go up here. He's got a crossbow. He hasn't seen me. This guy is one of the most ob oblivious players I think I've seen in my life. We can 100% pull this off, guys. If there was ever a chance, this is it. I'm going to put this down as well. Just because I want to get campfired up a little bit more. Okay. We've got a minute 27 to try and pull this off. Oh, God. Okay, that's enough health. That's enough health. All right, the door's ready to go. And we just got to find a way to get up on top of it without getting shot by this crossbow. I'm going to put some walls there just so we can't get a sneaky shot through the door. And all right, let's go. Come on, dude. Please let this work. Bring it around. Yes. We got it. Where is he? Where is he? Where is he? Where is he? He's right there. He's right there. Jump. No, the sign blocked it, you son of a... <laughs> well, I'm going to kind of count that one. Either way, that was an epic finish to the game and an even more epic round of Fortnite. We had 18 kills right there, guys. That was just that was just action from start to finish. And that is exactly the way I like my games of Fortnite. Now, guys, remember, we are going to have the new rapid base building grenade coming out tomorrow. So if you're not already subscribed to the channel, make sure you do because I'm going to be having a video out with not only some practical gameplay showing how we can use it for our own defenses, but I can already think of a whole bunch of dumb and nefarious ways we can use that to attack our enemies. And it's going to be awesome. But for now, guys... Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed, and I will see you legends in the next one. Bye-bye.